Hello, my friends. Today, I would like to share how to make Japanese red perilla seasoning. In Japanese, it is called shiso furikake. Furikake refers to those dried mixed seasonings made for sprinkling on top of rice. It has a wide range of flavors like salmon furikake, bonito furikake, wasabi furikake, etc. Siso furikake is my favorite one because it's purple color and distinct fragrance. People may be more familiar with the name of yukari, as yukari occupies 90% of Japanese market in Siso furikake category. Yukari is the trademark brand name of Siso furikake owned by Mishima Foods Corporation. Picking only the perilla leaves, rinse the leaves with water twice. Sprinkle 20 grams of salt over the perilla and mix well. Softly knead the leaves to remove harshness. Can you see this dark purple color? It contains harsh taste. Just discard it. Use another 20 gram of salt to repeat the same process one more time. Discard the purple water too. Now, let's add 200 cc of umezu, plum vinegar. You can also use apple vinegar or rice vinegar as substitute. Soak perilla leaves with plum vinegar for three nights in refrigerator. Now, we have beautiful bright purple color. Squeeze the plum vinegar out and spread each leaf on the colander. Dry under the sunlight for two days. When the plum vinegar is completely gone, crush leaves with a suribachi grinding bowl.
Now we have sisal powder. If we blend salt with sisal powder now, the sisal furikake is completed here. It can be used as seasoning, also for coloring. I will upload more sisal recipe in coming videos. Today, let's make a simple cucumber salad with sisal powder. Let me go to my vegetable garden to pick some cucumbers first. Just cut the cucumbers and sprinkle the sisal powder and the salt. Mix them well. It's done. Slice one chili for color decoration. The salad with sisal furikake tastes so good. I hope you will like it. Thank you for watching.